Welcome back to Star Sector, folks. We are down here at Atka Star System, uh, where we crawled back in the last one without any supplies, and we lost our tanker in the process, which really sucked. But luckily, we can buy a new one here for 27,000, so we're going to do that. And we'll quickly refit it with auxiliary fruit, fuel tanks, militarized subsystems, and let's take this up basically like we had the other one. So that gives us some more fuel. Now we do have some stuff on board. We have a couple of gamma cores that I want to sell. We have a beta core, which I might actually sell as, as well just to get the money. And we need to buy some supplies. Uh, black market, they don't have a whole lot. We'll get those. We'll fill up. It takes us down to 107,000. Uh, we have kind of enough crew. We have a lot of stuff on board. Which I want to head up to Valis and uh, get rid of. Cost of 300 supplies. <laughs> uh, so that means that we need more supplies, but we can't get those here. So let's leave. Oh, actually, before we leave, let's. No. So we'll head up to Groom on the way to Valis. And I think I'll fly up there and then I'll be right back. Alrighty, we are up here at uh, the Valis star system where I have dropped off everything that we had except for the two gamma cores and the beta core. I decided to sell all of them to uh, Tritachion and we made 150,000 from that, uh, which I spent some of. Uh, we have a bit more supplies now. We have a decent amount of fuel. We have 100 extra crew and we have an extra ship, an Omen. I really like omens. I think they are really good uh, little ships. So I bought one of those for 25,000 and I uh, refit it as well. So we have a litany thrower, uh, which is a energy weapon, I think. Uh, yeah, energy weapon, which does 750 damage. Pretty good. Then we have a Sabo and we have a Disavowal PD. So that's pretty decent. I gave it integrated targeting unit and resistant flux conduits. And it has very good uh, flux stats. So I like it. I like it a lot. Now, what do we want to do here? Uh, there are some bounties, but I don't think we can do any of them. We can't do any of them. However, we, there was a mission to analyze a domain or a probe. It's really far away. And I'm not sure that we can do it. Uh, let's just see. Uh, we can't get there and back again. Really? But what we can do is we know that there is a mining base here and we have this a promise thing which is down here so we could go and do those two and maybe explore these systems out here as well but first i want to stock up on as much stuff as i can uh, stuff being uh, both fuel and a lot of supplies I don't want to run out of supplies. So we'll do this. We have a lot of supplies, we have a lot of fuel, and that's all good. 
so let's see. We're up there, so let's head towards Dagon first. But are there any unexplored? Dagon is where? There. So I guess we'll head over here and then down here and then down here. Let's lay in a course and get going. Ponder on. And the reason that we're doing this is we, we, we need to make money, but we can't do the bounties yet. We simply we're simply not powerful enough to do the bounties that are offered. So we're going to have to find other ways of making money and to be honest, the little concerned man missions uh, or woman missions where we have to fly around and buy and sell stuff, well, sell stuff mainly, that's not really that fun. It's much more fun to, to explore. So that, that's what we're doing. Because we desperately need money. Delta Abraxas. Let's do a ping. There's something over here. What do we have Legion class battle carrier. Please let us be able to survive, to uh, salvage it, no, or recover it. Unfortunately, we couldn't recover it. But what was the thing that we just got? Uh, rich rare ore deposit. Okay, not too far away. What else do we have here? We have Delta Abraxas, a gas giant, a rocky metallic world, and a barren world. Let's just see. Now that, if we had been able to recover that legion, that could have changed things for us quite a bit. But unfortunately, we couldn't. No. We'll just head out. No ruins on any of them. I'm not gonna... I don't think I'm gonna... Uh, danger level high. We're not going in there. Two different systems, but there are planets up here. Let's head up there. We are not heading into the other one. Uh, let's do a quick save, just for good measure. What do we have? There's stuff. There is stuff. What's this up here? My weapons cache, nice. Hmm. Nothing great. Let's ping again. There's something over here. I think that's actually a fleet. It is. It's that remnant fragment. Despair, glimmer. Lumen, okay. Lumen to engage. Uh, the AI remnants are not currently hostile. Never mind. Let's open a con link. What? Con's crackle and the mesmerizing pattern of intervening lines take shape. Waiting query Omega. Scanning faults return. To interrupt contract holder with their attack area. Integrated space defense line of products and services. Have you considered a Tritachion orbital defense plan? Please contact the customer service representative for more information. Okay. Can I not 
leave? Why can't I leave? Newest to prevent you from disengaging easily. I don't think I have a choice here. That kind of sucks. I didn't want to engage those guys. Wow. One ship and goes down to one star. Let's just deploy U3 and just say full assault. I won't even bother piloting my ship, I think. Oh, my ship is actually taking damage. Yeah, I just took down the Lestrea, the, the hardest one. Uh, my ship is was taking damage because it wasn't being piloted at all, not by me, not by the AI. It's just going in a straight line. <laughs> Alright, that thing is down. Battle done, playing victory. Take through the wreckage. Couple of gamma cores, not bad. Mining blaster, mining laser, ion torpedo rack, light phase lens, PD laser. We'll take everything. Okay. There was more stuff in here, wasn't there? I think oh, there's a uh, ruins. Ruins. Extensive ruins. Explore them. Ooh, alpha core. Nice. And Diablo Amionix base blueprint package, which we know, so that's sixty grand. Automated repair unit. We'll take that. No, we'll take everything. Um, are we we are over our capacity all right there's two more things here there's something there in the corona can we get to it where well, it's not in there equipment cache explore Maximus class phase frigate. Okay. And a shield conversion front. Take that. Let's get out of here. And there's something down here. Where? There. Mining station. 120 crew, not bad. Another gamma core. Advanced optics, anti ship mine base, pirate blueprint, which we already know, two corrupted nano forges, very nice. Very, very nice. Let's drop off some metals. Over oh, here, we need to do a scanning. We'll do one more. Here there is nothing. Alright, that was not a bad system for us. Let's transfer us jump out. And we're not going in there, we'll head to Sukona. And we'll I think we'll do a quick save, just in case. I don't know if the remnants didn't attack us because we weren't hostile before, but we now are because of this one fight. That would kind of suck. Okay, no, no debris around there. Nothing. Doesn't seem like there's much here. Let's just do a quick ping over here. Nothing. We'll head up to the fringe jump point here and do a ping or two on the way. Hit a couple.
couple of asteroids probably. Uh, there's nothing in here. Okay. In that case, we will head down towards Alpha Al Naga. Uh, no, we don't want to go back to this corner. Come on, go this way. And this seems like a boring system. Actually, let's save before we jump in there, because boring systems can be dangerous, too. Uh, Alright, what's in here? No ships, or no uh, planets. Anything. This is just anarchist thugs. Don't want to fight those. Nothing. I think we'll just transverse jump out. And head down to Gamma on the gun. Oh. Hostile. Doesn't seem like there's anything in Gamma on the gun, but we will jump in there anyway. I wonder if they'll follow us in. My guess is yes, they will. There's nothing in here. Let's uh, ping. Nothing. Head up here and ping. Nothing. Alright, transfers jump out. Whoa, 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 whoa. There's something there as well. I think we'll head into Dagon, but we'll save. Warning beacon. A blue warning beacon, what's that? What is a blue warning beacon? I have no clue. Well, we'll jump in and find out in the next one, I guess. So, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.